What's up everybody? So I'm here with Harper. She's right here. Like she's helping me unbox. Unbox this. Present we got in the mail. What did we get, Harper? What did we get? We got some plastic. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, that's nice. We got like we got some fishing line. We got some gas king rails. All right, I'm gonna switch it to the other camera and do a real unboxing for you guys, but say hi to Harper. Hi, Harper. Look how pretty that is. Is that pretty? Yeah. She's like, I want more. I wanna open more. <laughs> we have to save some for the camera. You like that box? You like the fish line? What's up, everybody? So I hope you guys like that little unboxing and start with Harper. She's almost one. But uh, today we are looking at the Royale Legend Leech. Look at this. Oh my goodness. This thing is nice. First impressions, guys, when I unbox this thing, and I'm gonna go, I'm probably gonna end up going over all our designs. But the feel of it, the feel of it in my hand. I like how small the feature is. That gives you the opportunity. I don't know if you guys ever had this happen before, but you're fishing with a like a basic base caster, we'll say, and you set the hook, and the fish is bigger than you think, and the roll and the rod pops out your hand, and you're like, oh my goodness. Yeah, that being a small reel, you can really get your hand around that, and just, whoo, and it most likely it's not gonna happen again, so. I love that. I love it being a little bit smaller, easier to grab, easier to maintain. Um, the push button is nice and smooth, nice clicks, nice and loud and easy. Um, they, I'm, I'm seeing them a lot. Sorry, I apologize. But they have uh, great colors. There's four different color codes. You got blue. I throw up a picture right here. You got blue. This is six six to one gear ratio. You got. That's right. I got the fast one too red that is eight to one to one gear ratio seven one to one gear ratio and five three to one gear ratio five three to one is white seven one to one is the black like the old royale legend and like you see in the picture but guys i'm telling you right now get you one but they're awesome colors now the tension knob does not click which i personally like because i can really tighten that down and really get a fine adjustment on that tension to make that casting perfect. The uh, shield, the side plate is aluminum too and it's got aluminum bearing in here, not bearing but gear in here so the, um, it makes it a little bit lighter, it makes it more durable, but wait guys look at this. It's got the cool gears, if you guys can see, I'm gonna try to focus it for you guys. But the cool gear plate here, it has 11 settings. It goes all the way to 10 from zero. It has this little knob, like right here, it says open and close. You literally just turn it. It literally just pops open by itself. But it pops open by itself. <laughs> but it's really cool. It makes it easy access to that spool. And if you want to change the spool in the line, you can change it easy. And you just shut it back. You click that back in and it's locked into place. So you don't have to worry about losing your side plate, you have to worry about it getting damaged. It's it's on there pretty good. Like I've actually played around with this thing for a little bit before I did this video. It's got the rubber grip, which I kind of like. They feel really good, but we'll put it to the test out in the water for you guys. Star drag, they got the curve handle, which I really enjoy because it helps you get into that star drag quick. Because I don't know about you guys, but sometimes I forget I loosen my star drag and almost lose a fish. So it's good to get in there quick while you're reeling and be able to adjust that. So that's a really cool feature. And it's got 11 plus one double covered stainless bearings. I might have butchered that, but I'm telling you guys that is it's pretty awesome. That means salt water friendly. 
because I want to try to take this out. I love, I don't know about you guys, I know there's a lot of spinning reel fanatics out there. I'm a baitcaster fanatic. And I love if when I get a chance to throw a baitcaster in salt water and cast king giving you the opportunity to have. You got this one, I mean you got the Spartacus Maximus, you got so many baitcasters that they come out with. The original Real Legend was actually the one that I still have, saltwater friendly, and I have fish saltwater with it and it's still amazing. My original one, I call it my lucky charm. It's caught me so many big bass. It still works amazing, sounds smooth, and it still catches me big fish. I've saltwater fished with it. I've actually caught a giant black drum with it before. Like I think it was about 20 pounds, maybe 16 pounds. Oh, I never got it that one on scale, but he was massive. And that Royal Legend put up a fight. This, all these 17.6 pounds of carbon drag and that's amazing that should be plenty to fight fish I really want to try to catch a redfish on this for you guys don't know if that's gonna happen I've had really bad luck with redfish this year I'm trying maybe for my birthday it's coming soon but I'm gonna definitely catch some bass for the, on these for you guys so that that's that's nothing I can do that all day long but these things are nice. I'm, I'm preaching, preaching. I am a big Royal Legend fan. I have been for the start. Some of you guys really know how hardcore. I always recommend Royal Legend first. Like Southern Outdoors, he came to me a long time ago, like a few years ago. I put him into the Royal Legend and he's been hooked on Cast King too. So it's really nice. And Magic Yacker, I don't know if you guys watch him on YouTube, go check out his channel. We'll put a link in the description below. He's caught some redfish on these already. And they put up a good fight like he had some big redfish on these and these things were amazing they was held they did awesome and I kind of after that video made me want to buy not one but two I got two of them and I really want all four at least twice over I want I want the whole set I want my all my reels and rods to be royal legend like I don't know why, I almost feel like Casking created that for me, which I know they didn't, it's just me, little old Matt Rhodes, but it's like they knew what I wanted and they nailed it with the Warrior Legend combos and these elite ones make me very happy. I'm not kidding with you guys. I'm definitely going to preach and preach and preach until you guys get annoyed by me. But these things are nice, these things are amazing. I might have missed some features, so go over to Amazon, I'm going to put a link in the description. For the Amazon link, go check out all the features, check out all the combos and the colors, and check out all the reviews and stuff, guys. These things are good. There's a couple good reviews on there already, and these things have just come out. So, I can't wait to get on the water. I'm going to make you guys a on the water review with this one. And also, I got another combo in. I didn't make a video for, for the unboxing. I might go over some features with you guys, but it's, it's a spinning roll combo. Yeah, cats can come out with a spinning reel combo and it's really nice. And I want to put that link in the description. Go check that spinning reel combo out, guys. It's very, very affordable. And it'll get you out there in the water. And talking about affordable, the price point on this, to me, they nailed it right on the head. This It varies from $70 to $75. But to me, this feels like a $200 to $300 reel. So I really think they nailed the Elite Series price point. I don't think it's too expensive and uh, that's why I'm definitely going to buy more. And it's and I'm the kind of guy, I don't know if you guys watched me from the start or not, I don't like spending a lot of money on fishing gear. I like just getting fishing gear and then going and enjoying fishing. I'm just a weekend angler. I'm not, I don't beat these things up like tournament fishermen do. And I mean, I used to have done some tournament stuff before. I used to get out a lot and beat these things up. But lately, I don't get, I don't beat those up before, like before. But you know what I mean. I, uh, but I have a lot of fun. Sorry this video is so long with you guys. I've loved, I enjoy these so much. If you guys, give me the thumbs up. If you can hit, let's say, 300 likes on this video. I think that's worth it. 300 likes, I'm going to. I'll get one of these reels for you, one of you lucky subscribers. So 300 likes on this video. Be sure to share so we get those likes up there. Make sure you comment too. 
And also, guys, make sure you go over to Casking's YouTube channel, subscribe, subscribe to my channel, and we'll see you next time, guys. Remember, get out.